a homemaker's work never ends. In between cleaning, cooking, mopping, taking care of the children and sometimes caring for elders, her life is an endless whirl of chores to complete and people to take care of. Life is very simple and we homemakers make it difficult for ourselves. When you feel that you are overstressed by managing everything, that is the time to take a break, sip a glass of water, slow down in your life and spend some time with yourself so that you can make a fresh start. As my kids are having off from school today, I had enough time in my hands to spend my morning in a peaceful way. On such days, I try not to do any major cleaning. Instead, I try to spend my time doing the things that I love to do. And one such thing that I love to do is setting up my dining table in a different way each time so that it gives some newness to my home. When you add new additions in your home and kitchen, you just not add them at the same time you have to care for the things because durability of any product depends upon our usage. And one such item is this organizer that I bought recently. As I keep some breakfast essentials in it, it needs to be cleaned regularly. It only takes 5 to 10 minutes for doing such work but I think it has a great impact in your daily cleaning. As kids are home today, I wanted to give them something that is very easy to make at the same time that is liked by my kids. So I saw this recipe somewhere on Instagram and wanted to make it since then. In a bowl, I have added 2-3 to three tablespoons of butter and sugar. Usually icing sugar is used in this recipe but since I am trying not to be perfectionist today, I have taken regular sugar. On a whole wheat bread, I have applied a generous amount of cream cheese. You can use any cheese that is available at your home. Then applied a good amount of butter on one side of the bread and placed it on the pan. Then I will cook the bread until it is golden brown and crisp from both the sides. My daughter wanted to turn her table into a hospital and I was helping her in that. Later, I took the opportunity to clean and reorganize the study table. Usually, my son cleans up this space, but 
today i wanted to do it by myself this allows me to look into what are the items that are needed to be discarded and that are needed to be organized we as a homemakers make a lot of efforts stand hours in the kitchen just to make a best variety of food possible for our family not caring for ourselves most of the times but i think it is okay if you are not making something special all the time because sometimes even a simple meal prepared by you can touch the heart of your family provided you are making it with all the love so one such recipe that i am making today is dal fry so for that i have chopped all the vegetables such as onions tomatoes green chilies ginger and garlic then in a kadai i have added 2 to 3 tablespoons of oil then goes mustard seeds dried chilies and chopped garlic ginger and green chilies i will just cook them for 1 minute then add the chopped onions into it then i will cover and cook the onions for 5 minutes until it changes its color while i see the onions have changed slightly its color then i will add chopped tomatoes into it <coughs> again i will cover and cook the tomatoes until they are soft in a pressure cooker i have added the soaked lentils half teaspoon of oil and some turmeric powder then i will pressure cook it for 5 minutes until the lentils are soft when the tomatoes have turned soft added few curry leaves red chili powder turmeric powder and salt give it a good mix and added 2 uh, to 3 tablespoons of water covered and cook for 5 minutes i then added cooked lentils into the gravy gave it a good mix and added half a lemon into it covered and cook for another 5 minutes at last added a handful of coriander leaves and a tablespoon of ghee into it mixed it properly and that's it it's ready to be served as a side dish i am preparing a simple potato fry for that in a pan i have added some oil added mustard seeds and thinly cut potatoes into it covered and cook for 5 minutes until the potatoes are slightly brown in color i then added chopped curry leaves and green chilies into it tossed it very well added some salt red chili powder and turmeric powder
tossed it very well and i will cover and cook for another 5 to 10 minutes or until the potatoes turn slightly brown in color at last i have added a handful of coriander leaves and lemon into it adding lemon is optional but try to add it because lemon gives that tangy flavor to the potatoes so simple potato fry is ready within no minutes I think no Indian family is complete without the evening tea so I made some nice tea for me and my husband So that's it for today's video I hope I was able to share some amount of positivity with my vlog I will meet you all in my next video until then take care